Oh god, that tastes like dollar store. What's going on everyone? It's me again and I'm back for another new video and today I'm gonna do another food taste test and I'm gonna dig in into the dollar store one dollar meat or one dollar meal so I haven't tried any of this yet before so it got me curious and I got them yesterday and yeah I want to see for myself how a dollar meat and a dollar meal taste them. first I have a pork loin chops so so it looks like and as you can see like it's very thin but I guess you get what you're paying for I mean I don't mind that this is this thin as long as it's a real meat then you know I have no complaint I pay a dollar I got real meat if it's even real meat I hope so but it has a bone in it so I think it's a real meat but it's really thin like it's like one fourth inch thin so and then who would think you can get a ribeye steak for one dollar and again it's really thin slice so you get what you're paying for but it's not bad let's just hope that it tastes better it says made with USA beef and the last one I got is this is a rice with beef and peppers so it's like um, bell pepper sauce with rice and seasoned beef patty so this one is microwavable and this one I need to cook it in the pan so yeah let's try this so basically this is my lunch for today and to complete my lunch I need a drink so I got this Hershey's so I got this Hershey's mm, milkshake and it's cookies and cream milkshake got this bad boy for a dollar so I'm gonna prepare this all first and then I will come back and show you the finished product I'm excited yeah. okay I'll be back in a minute That's basically a three dollar lunch for me today. So I'm gonna show you how it looks like. The pepper and beef rice, and then this one is the steak, the ribeye steak, and this one right here is the pork loin. By the way, these pork are already seasoned in the package, so I didn't put any seasoning in it, but pepper and then I use olive oil and little butter and then I put garlic in the frying pan and I think I just cook each side for like a minute or two because they're really thin and this one I microwave it for four and a half minutes my lunch so let's dig into it I'm gonna use this dollar store towel as my napkin for today let's get started let's so let's try the pork first like i said these are already seasoned so i just put pepper and garlic and olive oil Yeah, it's actually good. I mean, the the meat is really tender, and even though I cook it for about 
30 second more I mean the meat is still tender it's not dry so you don't want to cook it for a long time so because you don't want to dry it out mm. yeah it tastes like pork it tastes like real meat to me and it's a real meat and it's not dry so if you cook it right it will turn out good but if not then you will end up with a dry shitty meat so let's try this ribeye steak Ooh, I'm feeling so fancy eating a dollar ribeye steak huh you can't beat that so it looks like Yeah, it's a beef I can tell it's a beef but of course you know you can tell the quality of the meat isn't great because this one seems kind of dry to me and the fact that I cook it faster than the pork yeah because it's hard for you to cook this like medium rare if you want because it's really thin so most of the time I think you will probably end up uh, cooking it well done but it's okay I mean it's not great but it's okay hmm now let's try the rice I mean this one this is all like this is all rice like I can see bits of meat then the bell pepper where's the bell pepper see there's almost like no bell pepper in here so yeah so let's taste it oh I think that's a bell pepper right there itadakimasu That's a good flavor, very basic flavor. You can taste the tomato sauce. It's well seasoned. And the meat, yeah, and it tastes like beef. You can taste the beef. The meat is tender. But for some reason, I'm not sure if this is actually real beef because the texture is kind of weird to me. Maybe it's not real beef, but the flavor is decent. I like it. I'm not a big eater, so I like everything. I can also eat like this. Yummy, yummy, poor man's made. Fancy lunch that only rich people like me can afford. So, bitch. Move on. Next. <laughs> oh god, that tastes like dollar store. Okay, let's try put some barbecue sauce. Just a little. I'm not a big fan of barbecue sauce, but I wanna try the barbecue sauce. Feeling fancy again, eating a dollar meat in a sunny Thursday afternoon all by yourself. Pour the one with barbecue sauce. Beautiful sunny Thursday today. I may go run and hunt for bears. Find real meat. What you think? What you think? What you think? 
gonna taste this Lind Linder milk chocolate truffle bar. I don't give a fuck about truffle as long as it is chocolate. I'm happy. This is a three dollar lunch. Personally, I will pref I prefer to eat this over getting like a burger and fries at McDonald's because this is more food than the McDonald's food and it's not bad at least for me um, it has a decent taste it has a decent flavor and it will fill me up well for me it will fill me up because I'm a small eater so I mean I will eat this again but you know that's my preference my personal preference oh and let's try this Hershey's milk milkshake Smells like milkshake. I'm not sure about, about cookies and cream taste, but it tastes like milk chocolate. My verdict is that dollar store meat, it's not the best. I mean, you get what you paid for. The taste is decent, it's good, it's not bad. I mean I can eat this it will fill me up at least for me so what is your favorite dollar food so let me guys know what is your favorite dollar food I mean any kind of food that you find in a dollar store what is your favorite and let me know maybe I would give it a try so that's all for today and please subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet and click the notification bell so you're notified right every time I upload a new video and like this video and I'll see you in the next one bye, -bye.